The impact on the liver is what causes this to be such an effective shot. If we look here at our anatomy, we're looking straight on at the body and the liver sits up in the right upper part of the abdominal cavity, a little bit off to that right side. Essentially protecting the liver, we have our rib cage, we have some muscles that are along the chest wall. We then have the diaphragm that sits just outside of the liver that helps with breathing. But that shot from Garcia came in basically right here on the lower part of the rib cage pushing into and distributing force into the liver. When this punch makes contact with Campbell's right side of his body, that energy is getting transferred through the skin into the muscles, into the rib cage, but then ultimately is getting transferred into the liver as well. That shock wave that comes into the liver here stretches this capsule that surrounds the liver and is innervated by something called the parasympathetic nervous system. Now our nervous system is divided into essentially the sympathetic and the parasympathetic. The sympathetic is the fight or flight, the stress response that gets our heart rate up, and the parasympathetic is more the rest and digest. The key nerve in the parasympathetic system is the vagus nerve. It's actually one of our cranial nerves and it's this big long nerve that starts all the way up near our brainstem and then basically runs down through almost the entirety of the chest cavity, helping with innervation in the various organs, the heart, and has a role in a lot of key physiologic functions. When that punch comes in, the energy goes into the liver, goes in and stretches the capsule. That electrical signal goes back up through the nervous system, activating the parasympathetics with that vagus nerve. That activation is what sends this just crazy intense, basically shock through your entire body. That surge of parasympathetic activity can cause your heart rate to go down, it can cause your blood pressure to drop, it's gonna make you feel nauseous, lightheaded, dizzy. It's gonna basically cause a physiologic shutdown of your body because of this impact centered at the liver. When the punch comes in here, initially he's feeling the pain from the rib contact. He's feeling the pain from just the blow to the muscles. But right as this punch continues to go through, these electrical signals right now are being sent up through those parasympathetics. That vagus nerve is starting to get activated, but it's not until a second or so later that those effects are fully realized by the body, and that's why this is delayed. Now, a blow that's this severe is also gonna deliver enough energy that it can actually cause bleeding and lacerations within the liver itself. The liver is extremely vascularized because of how it helps with removing toxins and digestion and breakdown of products in our body and it's very susceptible to sheer injuries. And so part of Campbell's evaluation is probably gonna be looking to make sure he doesn't have any sort of laceration or damage to his liver.